name's Keely and I'm a cuddle therapist. If you don't know what that is, check out the other videos on my page. <laughs> So generally speaking, there's like two types of sessions. There's two modus operandi, if you will. One type of session is prescriptive. In the prescriptive model, I am leading you through different poses. I am approaching this from a, these positions will help different kinds of bodies in different ways, that mentality. They're called flows or transitions. The second type of session is client-led. Client-led sessions are way more about empowerment. They look a little bit closer to coaching. They look a little bit closer to some kinds of talk therapy when you're incorporating also somatic experiencing. Both client-led and prescriptive models of cuddle therapy are beneficial for different kinds of people. Like and follow if you're curious about what those benefits are and check out my next video for what kinds of people benefit from each model. Review of the Cuddleist Cuddle Therapy Training Program in 15 seconds. Pro, it's inexpensive for the quality that you're getting and has after training resources like marketing and community support. Con, there's no in-person option and honestly, it is a little short. I wanted more. The thing that makes it unique is it's the most comprehensive on boundary setting and empowering your client. My review of the Cuddle Sanctuary Training Program in 15 seconds. Pro, there's both in-person and online options and it's the most balanced between technical and practical information. Con, it's the most effective if you're in Los Angeles. What makes it unique is that they have test clients for you to actually practice sessions with and give you real world experience. Review of the Certified Cuddlers Training Program in 15 seconds. Pro, the online option is video based, so if you're a visual learner, it really helps. Con, it's most effective if you're in Portland, Oregon. What makes it unique is this comprehensive list of cuddle positions and how they're best utilized for each different client's needs. Hey, my name's Keely. I'm a cuddle therapist. And today we're talking about the two different kinds of models of cuddle therapy, prescriptive versus client-led. In the prescriptive model, I take clients through different poses, sort of choreographed out of a care plan that we decide based on what their goal is. This model can be helpful for people who are quite timid, for people who have not experienced much platonic touch in their life, so they don't even know what are possibilities to ask for, or for people in very high demand decision-making jobs where they don't want to make any decisions and want to be taken care of. The client-led model involves much more collaboration and co-creation. It involves more exercises and activities as well as poses and can include coaching and relationship conversation. This model is more appropriate for people who are looking for personal growth. It's better for people who are trying to de deal with discomfort around touch, overcome discomfort around touch, or who have a trauma history. And one of the primary goals is that people walk away feeling empowered and with a sense of agency. Like and follow for more information on cuddle therapy.